Hello everyone. I am Divarani Pandurang Baba, working as an assistant professor at AISSMS IIT Pune. Today we are going to discuss what is incremental model. Now see this figure. Incremental model is what? Actually, incremental model is a process of software development. where requirements are divided into multiple stand alone modules of the software development cycle so in this model each module goes through the requirements design implementation and testing phases each and every subsequent release of the module adds function to the previous release so the process continues until the complete system achieved now requirement analysis is the first phase of the incremental model in this phase the product analysis expertise and identifies the requirements and the system functional requirements are understood by the requirement analysis team to develop the software under the incremental model this phase performs a very important role second phase is design and development phase in this phase the design of the system functionality and the development method are finished with success when software develops new practically the incremental models uses style and development phase in testing phase incremental model checks the performance of each existing function as well as additional functionality in the testing phase the various methods are used to test the behavior of each and every task last phase is implementation implementation phase enables the coding phase of the development system it involves the final coding the design in the designing and development phase it provides testing functionality in the testing phases after the completion of this phase the number of the product working is enhanced and upgraded up to the final system product now when we use the incremental model when the requirements are superior when a project has a lengthy development schedule when software team are not very well skilled or trained when the customer demands a quick release of the product and when you can develop prioritized requirements first in this cases incremental model is used now there are some advantages of incremental model first one is errors are easy to be recognized second one is easier to test and debug incremental model is more flexible simple to manage risk because uh, it handled during its iterations the client gets important functionality early so these are the advantages of incremental model now there are some disadvantages of incremental model first one is need for good planning second one is total cost is high third one is well defined module interfaces are needed these are the disadvantages of incremental model 